for me, a key attribute to Peter's success is his determination to overcome problems. If he comes up against an obstacle, he just says, right, we've got this problem, how do we fix it? And if he can't fix it, he just learns to manage it. Just a uh, good attention to detail. We just like to do everything right. And um, Don and I are a very good team. The most recent major challenge we've had is uh, two successive crop failures due to major flooding. I mean, our plans for the, for the next five years, I guess, had to change overnight. I think the future of this farm is going to be probably a little bit more mixed farming. Just the issues that we're having with nematodes and, and things like that. What's happened with the nematodes, we've had to adapt and look at our efficiencies and look at the whole management of all those things. I have a, a passion for farming, particularly um, grain cotton, grown up with it been with it all my life and I uh, still have a major passion for it. I just love it. We're not doing anything remarkably different other than implementing things in a, in a very efficient and manageable way. We have an underlying philosophy of maximum whole farm profitability attributable to minimising overhead cost expenses and have maximum yields on the minimum area for the water we have available. McIntyre Downs is a, it's an outstanding farm in, within the district and, and within the cotton industry, which can mainly be attributed to the on-farm staff who do an excellent job, great attention to detail and, and execution in what they do. They're just incredibly consistent and they're, they're an in, incredibly tight team. Global Ag is a long-term player in agriculture in Australia. They specifically want to be a good steward to the industry and to agriculture generally. We have strong workplace health and safety guidelines, also environmental and the best management practices is strongly uh, encouraged and adhered to. I think our level of intensity is pretty unique. We have about a thousand hectares of cropping country and we try to crop a thousand hectares per year of crops which is pretty intense and a high proportion of that is cotton so that's pretty unique but also from a personal point of view I try and put all of our information into spreadsheets and data it really helps me to get my head around you know what the decisions we're making and how they're impacting our profitability and there's a lot of emotion involved with farming and get rain at the wrong time or you get really great yields and it's sometimes difficult to put down you know what what's helped us or what's caused that and uh, so by having all the, the numbers in a spreadsheet, I can go back and really think about it in a logical, rational way and make decisions based on data and information rather than on the emotion. So I'm just addicted to making spreadsheets. If I've got a decision I have to make or I'm uh, trying to, um, to assess something, I, I put a spreadsheet together and you can see everything very clearly and quickly and um, that's just my, one of my favourite things to do.